are back in pure solar, and it's time to set the final wheels in motion. Children, once we go down to Clevo's dimension, there's no turning back. Are you ready to go? So, that sends us immediately to the medium mobile, and the dimension option appears at the end. Let's see what horrors await us. the crazy old guy in tow. Strangers, I've never seen you before. So there is something out there. I had no idea. I thought this place was everything. Harvest of crops, they stop growing. People keep living. Never grow up. This place is falling apart. Let's pull this pop stand. Not the most random thing we've seen this game. I'm starting to propose calling this place Dunwich, but... Secondary title for this place would definitely be Silent Hill after seeing that building. I think this is the last one. Silent Hill angle. Quite a bit of a psychological element going on there. Excuse me, ladies and gentlemen, I must ask that you halt and stay your business. Visitors are not allowed past these walls. Eric, well, maybe we should stop. We have the time, remember, this is a place of Clebo's design. Nothing here is real. That spear you only looks awfully real. Do not be afraid. Clebo's not one to create anything that would harm us. I order you to stop. Piss off. I... You spoony bard. See, what did I tell you? What does that even mean? Play Final Fantasy IV to find out. Clebo's dead. Oh, this place certainly is huge. Do we have... Okay, the giant spider bosses. A random encounter here. Good to know. Where are our weights? That's the towel. There's the weight. And I wonder if I should put a... Flea flute on Alina. Okay, there 
might have been some sort of puzzle there that I accidentally did. And I probably should fight one of these enemies to see if they're actually worth fighting. Clebo's hair. Okay, this definitely is going up to new levels of creepy. fighting and the uh, spider has something like 2,500 hit points. But what I was about to say is I could put a real weapon on Alina instead of sticking to her bow. I think that's the only thing that stopped me from getting another achievement, so... Could go that way. Crap. Okay, I'm fighting him with a flea flutey foot. Ericol, I've been expecting you. Ah, and I would have thought that this visit was a surprise. Bethana is attempting to rebuild pure solar, and you want my help to stop her. Ma, well, you've become clairvoyant in your old age, Clebo. May I ask how this information managed to reach you? I had a visit from her as well. And yet you still breathe. Which wouldn't be the case if you hadn't given her what she wanted. Sharp as always. I expected no less, Ericol. But I'd like you to do something out of the ordinary for once. Oh. I want you to listen to me. It's been centuries since I've set foot in that world. Though I can't imagine human nature has changed much. You can guess correctly. Though we do have ice cream. Did you not feel safer trespassing in this world than living in the other? Seems more like a failure in your design, really. the same side before, Bethna's motives are pure. I disagreed with her methods last time, it sounded like... Slavery? Precisely. But her theories now, Eric, they're brilliant. I can't imagine they are much different than they were then. She will not rule over that world, Eric. She's been working on a method of changing people's minds. Holding them. That was the flaw in her original plan. People wouldn't want her as a leader. This way, you see how much better this is, don't you? I fail to see the distinction, Clebo, but I imagine you've experienced her theories firsthand. That he has. My first test subject, if you will. A resounding success, if I may say so. I imagine your mind is considerably stronger, though, my old friend. You never know, I've gotten older, and then again, I see you have too. Were you so frightened of me that you had to bring children to protect? It's you. That's correct, this is his son, Austin. He'll be the last thing you see. I didn't get a clear look at him before. He does look so much like his father. Pardon us for changing the subject, ma'am. I believe you two are having a battle of wits. This changes much. Clebo, he's not going to be one like this. Eliminate them and return to me. Keep the child. Go to hell. He has his father's spirit. Clebo? I'll see you soon, Queen. Well, I think it's safe to say that locking yourself up in another dimension makes you go a little shack wacky. Let's kick some ass. Careful, children. We, he may be outnumbered, but his powers are great. I'm sorry you had to be like this, Eric Hall. I'm not. I always thought you deserved a good boot to the head. Okay, they did not say anything about four of them in the achievement. Okay. So I'm gonna gather. Have her gather. I'm gonna hit them with a supernova. I'm gonna jack crawlers. And if you're wondering why Edison has four, that's the effect of his ultimate weapon. Okay. 
Okay, what is going on here? Oh, okay, it was just a really long animation. And you can see that all of Edison's gather is gone now, which is why I'm not really a fan of those five point moves. Once you go past two, any hit knocks you back down, so it's not really worth using. Anyway, ameliorate. Life water costs five? Holy crap, that thing is worthless. Let's lay down the AoE. One down. Okay, right here would actually be a good time to actually stop the spell animation, but it's gonna keep going and going. I'm going to assume that's probably water element, so you can equip towels to mitigate it, but I just have the achievement to steer me. And I don't say anything about his element there, sadly. Anyway, Kona Hockley. You see his spells. Toxic plant costs four, yeah, not happy. Start going to stabby stabby mode. The question is, can he replace those copies of himself, or is this one pretty much already over? Wow, he does not like Crawler. gather to power pyro petrol. Thousand. Okay, I think... Actually, how many boss achievements are there? Two after this? Well, one pop here. Time to put an end to this madness. Hostin, kids, it was a pleasure to have met you. What? Aircall, don't be a fool. We can defeat him together. No, you can't. I must do this so that you can have any chance against Bethna. Aircall, don't. I'm glad to know you'll be the ones carrying this task. I live for too long anyway. It's time to retire. Goodbye, my friends. Okay, that one could have used a bit of reviewing. Ericol, Ericol, please get up. Elena, he's, they're both. Austin, I know what it's not. We can get through this. We just have to. No, I mean, what's happening to you? What? Elena, at a sound. Crawler, Zelini. My child. Is this home? Oh, I can move. Yeah, it's moving behind the tree so I can't even see my. 
should have done with all these watermelons around. Sooner or later someone would start fermenting the damn things. I don't actually 
wish I knew how much hit points this guy has, but now I'm topped off since I dodged. You were out for a while. Wait, what happened? Where's Bethana? Where's Ericol? He managed to stop Clebo. He saved us all. How many more people need to perish because of Bethana's madness? We have to put a stop to this now. In a moment, Austin. We all need to rest. I think we're safe here. Great. Looks like this place is, looks like the place is stable. Doesn't seem to need Clebo to continue to operate. We don't know the extent of Clevo's influence over this world. What will happen to it when it starts to move on its own? You mean... Things might be significantly more dangerous now. Well, that's reassuring. is lame. Let's see what kind of mob is waiting for us outside. What the? So the people have turned into frogs, have they? echelons of the organization, so maybe five or six strong. Then Cleo Neo and finally Bethany herself. Assuming that the all-powerful Hyper Witch has no security beyond a couple of cultists and a groupie. So best case scenario is eight to five against. Worst case scenario is, well, a significantly more irregular fraction. We don't have a choice. Like Eric Hall said, we can't go back. And on to Bethany it is. And once that's over, we get to go home. sent me here. So I'm going to put the break here. In the next video, we will try to wrap things up. I'm the Hero of Light. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.